one hour later. Hello, Karen. I'm tired. I feel asleep late. I had to finish my literature homework. Really? Now, I understand why you were tired in the fifth class today. I hate that subject. Most of my classmates do the same thing. We should advise our teacher to adjust the delivery times of reading assignments. I hope he doesn't get mad. But someone must talk to him, no matter if he gets mad. However, we should give that advice to managers to give us a 15 minutes break to eat something. I agree with you. It's horrible to be in the last classes on an empty stomach. It's great advice. By the way, a few days ago, I saw that you were using the cell phone in class. What are you doing it? My best friend had something to tell me, so I had to answer her right then. I'll give you some advice. You should stop doing that. Some of my friends had failed the exams for not paying attention to the class. Okay, okay. I will stop doing that. I appreciate that you care about me. Well, I have seen that the exams have been difficult. I think that the teachers should be more flexible. I will give them advice. True. Even in a couple of weeks, the evaluation begins. But not all the responsibility lies with the teachers. Some of them have difficulties teaching the class because their computers do not work well or the classrooms are not in good conditions. And unfortunately, the government doesn't do anything about either. We shall send an email to our authorities to do something about it. Yes, we should communicate with our colleagues so that they respond to us more quickly. One more thing, I've been thinking about proposing to wear some shirt or jacket with our university's logo. Do you think I should? Maybe. Some t-shirts my friends wear look comfortable, but wearing casual clothes is cool. I don't know, Raul. It's okay. Well, give me a minute. I must go to prepare my dinner and start doing my homework. Don't worry, I must do the same. I'll send you a message later. Bon appetite. Bon appétit, too.